the first button we're going to check and you know the first option in the menu is the sound one is this one and it takes us here we have a couple of options down below we have options frequency obviously to change the frequency you change the channels pretty much what you are listening to some presets if you have saved some radios obviously you can just navigate through them Way now, if you wanna from... if you wanna have them as a list you'll be able to see the list of uh, the radio channels that you can uh, actually listen to uh, my favorite one it's halam fm which is not here unfortunately uh, for some weird reason and yeah pretty much that's uh, that's about it let's go to the first option options we have in here radio stations music files radio settings managing photos which i don't know why they are here but it's kind of like you know radio media options and audio settings radio stations it just goes back to the list where it shows the radio stations you can choose between fm dub and obviously going to the uh, presets when you're saving them music files obviously if you have some uh, um, some sort of an external source like an usb or a bluetooth source or something like that you can filter them through here you have playlists and everything i have never used it just because i'm listening through bluetooth directly from me too but that's a personal choice radio settings obviously uh just three options uh, alternative frequency fm dub if you want to like kind of be able to switch between them it does it automatically to have the best quality display radio text and then you have the announcements which um you have traffic announcements, weather, flash, news, sport, financial info, shit like that. So, um, yeah, again, I, I never use it just because I'm using YouTube for everything. Managing photos, if you have photos in the, uh, as an example, in the USB uh, uh, flash drive, you, you will be able to see them here. Again, never used it. Audio settings. Now, the audio settings is quite interesting because you can actually change um, how loud uh the, the music or you know the whatever the audio is going to be in different uh, in different parts of the car and um, you do have an option obviously the first option is to uh, work out with the bass with the medium or with the treble you know the, the way the way you want it i want a bit more bass and then the rest of them i want them flat but that's me and then you have the balance not with the balance this is the magic you can choose where you want for the sound to actually come from like a bit louder uh, if you like your music to be a bit louder uh, and as an example let's say if you have kids in the back or whatever who's traveling is not really into that you can just change it for you so that's that's actually beautiful right the sound itself a few options if you want to have uh you know like different settings for this it's just a matter of uh, how you actually prefer them that's how i keep it voice the volume of the voice ouch ringtone that's you know when you receive calls i don't keep it because again everything is connected directly through the phone and i can see it on the phone so i prefer to have it like that right let's go back frequency uh presets list sources that's about it quite of a quick one uh 